hello everyone and welcome back to the channel so i'm so excited to be grabbing this camera again trying to get more consistent with this because it is hard it has been hard and um yeah just trying my best um today I'm actually picking up the camera a little later in the day so if you hear that I'm talking a little low it's because I just put Camila to bed um, it is about eight o'clock right now but this is the time that I had time to do this so I've been excited because I waited for this um, I've been waiting for this order from Shane for the longest time and it's finally here so I am super excited to share what I got with you guys and I am really surprised at how um, good quality the things were I've ordered from Shane before but the items that I've ordered um, is my first time ordering um, items like that I order stuff for the bathroom so like decor for the bathroom is my first time ordering stuff for the bathroom so I was pleasantly surprised with what I um, got in return um, so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and do that I am exhausted but bear with me um, this is gonna be a short and precise video on the things that I purchased so let me place you guys down here hopefully I kind of messed around with it for a little bit to make sure. Well, the first item that I got was this shirt. It is like a um, like a oversized T-shirt that says "Cool Mom" because who doesn't want to be a cool mom, right? But I loved it because the color is great and it has black lettering. And um, I wore this today to take Mila to her speech therapy and it was so comfy. The material is durable, it's stretchy, and it just feels really great. The sleeves are not so tight. They're really loose and they feel great. This is actually extra large and I'm glad I went with an extra large because if I went, if I had gone with a 2X, it would have been way too big. But there was only an extra large in this shirt. I was like let me try it out and I am so glad I did because it literally falls right on my thigh covering a little bit of my butt and um, it's great and I love the color and you know it says cool mom I'm a cool mom guys you're a cool mom so I'm gonna go ahead with the clothing first and then I'll go ahead with the other stuff I did open some of the clothing because I wanted to see how it looked because I was so excited to receive the package. I couldn't wait, so I'm sorry. I couldn't wait. Um, as you can see, I wore it today. And um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and check out, show you guys the items, the clothing items. I got two pieces for Camila, um, three pieces including this shirt for myself. So I will go ahead and show you guys that. I'm gonna set it down. So since we started with my stuff, I'll go ahead and show you guys what I purchased. I went ahead and purchased this shirt. Um, I thought it was going to be big when I looked at it. And it actually fits really well when I put it on. I looked at it and I was like, hmm, it's so big. But I actually like the way it fits. But it's this black um, feather shirt. Um, the material is like, hmm, it's not silk. Um, no, it's not silk. I think it's cotton, to be quite honest. Um, but it is light. It is breezy. The sleeves are not tight. Again, I don't like tight sleeves because I don't like my arms. I don't like my arms. And I don't like to um, basically bring attention to them. So I do go for a wider arms shirt. And the color is black. So it is black with feathers, pink feathers and green feathers. So I love um, shirts like this to go to church, um, to go on a date night or something like that. Um, you can pair it with jeans or you can dress it up with a nice um, pencil skirt and I think it will look really nice. So 
there was one of them and I love the details in the front with the basically the, the cut open here with the, the V cut but then it has like the string so it doesn't separate completely so it gives me a little bit of opening without exaggerated cleavage pretty much so I got that let's put it inside here and this item oh my god um I think I paid like six bucks for this dress really nice and um, I loved it when I saw it the material is um, like stretchy material, kind of um, feels silky, um, but um, it's a little thicker. It is a little on the see-through side, which is okay because I wear shorts underneath anyways of my dresses, or I either plan to wear it with a nice cardigan. I'm planning to buy a duster for it and kind of wear it with a long duster. And um, I love this dress because you can dress it up and that's what was, that was items that I was looking for was items that I could dress up and dress down so I could dress this dress up and dress it down with sneakers and I think it will go really well um, it is um, spaghetti straps it has like a round cut and it is striped and it is long but not long to the floor it's not maxi it's more like a medium length and it is fitted um i did get this in a 2x because i um i don't like things way too tight on myself um i could have gone bigger but i am losing weight and i don't want it to fit me way too big to the point where i can't wear it um but i feel like i'll be able to wear this and if i lose weight i'll still be able to wear it so it is long, no slips, which most dresses come with slip now, and I don't really like them. Um, I feel like slips don't really go well with um, duster dresses because the duster tends to cover up the dress. So I wanted something just straight, um, no cuts in between or anything. And if I want to dress it down, I could just wear a denim jacket for the um, spring that's coming up. I could wear a denim jacket and just with some white sneakers and just make it look really cute. Isn't this pretty? I'll skip that just a little bit. But it goes all the way down. It is really pretty. I don't have a full body length mirror. I do plan on getting one. And maybe these Shane hauls and clothing hauls would be much better because you guys get a better view of what it looks like um but i won't be wearing it anytime soon until i find the perfect um duster for it so i'm still on the lookout so if you guys know any places to sell nice duster and if you don't know what a duster is it's kind of like a cardigan but it goes all the way it's like really really long um let me know let me know on your on the comment section if you guys know a good place where i can purchase one because i, I am on the lookout so yeah this was the item for myself so that was it for me um i did buy camila two outfits they're so cute um outfit number one spring is coming she is getting taller and um, i do like wearing dresses on her so i needed a few pieces to add to her closet um so i bought this dress for her again the colors are so cute the floral print is so pretty it's like a yellow with a green and um, it is long look at it it's so pretty and um, it has the scrunchy material here it has two little hooks because there is a belt that goes with it but not just a belt guys because the clothes that they make now for kids they're just so amazing you guys need to check out Shane for um, toddler dresses toddler clothes or anything like that so the dress came with this little cute shirt. Look at this. Like that's an outfit that I would wear. It is so cute. Look at the detailing of the shirt. It's like roughly it's buttoned down. You can unbutton it here and kind of wear like a little tie-up shirt. But this is like so cute with it together. And it also came with a like a wicker belt look at this so cute 
So I came with that. Um, I wanted something light for the summer that she can also wear. I mean, for the spring that she can also wear through the summer. So that is outfit number one for Miss Mila Mila. Um, outfit number two. She tried this one on. She loved it. Didn't want to take it off. Um, this outfit does come with a shirt that I would not wear on my daughter. Unless it's with a shirt underneath. Kudos to all the mothers that do that, but I just don't want to do that to my daughter. Um, she doesn't need to be showing her belly at the age of three. So, um, she will not be wearing this, but I bought it for the skirt because the skirt is so cute and it was super cheap, even for the skirt. So, um, I will link everything down below so you guys can see how cheap it was. Um, and yeah, so this is the shirt. It's cute, but it's just... My three-year-old would not be wearing this. No. Um, as cute as it is, unless I wear a shirt underneath or, I don't know, a shirt underneath that would go tucked in so that way when she raises her hands it won't show her belly. And, you know, that's probably the only way she would wear that. There's just no way. So check out the skirt. Look at this. I love skirts for my daughter. I go to church and on Sundays, I like to dress her up so cute, so I think this is super cute. I'll give you a close-up so you guys can see the colors. If this doesn't scream, scream spring, I don't know what that is, but I just saw it and I was like, oh my god, that is just such a spring outfit, you know, with the skirt, the colors. And I can always wear the skirt alone with one of these colors in here and open some sandals, I could just see it, so. I envisioned it and I will put this skirt on her, take pictures, and hopefully let you guys know how it worked out. I don't know about the shirt, but we'll keep it for now. So those are her two outfits. So now, moving on to the bathroom and stuff. Um, I needed some new bathroom stuff, so we'll get tired of the the core in the bathroom right now. So a common video on the decorations of the bathroom. But um, I need a new stuff. Um, I love my de my decoration but I just want to put them away and kind of rotate it out. So um, you guys seen the first video. Colors were beautiful so I kind of like those colors. I love floral prints so anything with leaves floral prints I'm all for it. So of course you girl had to get something similar but not quite so um, let me start with the shower curtain yes shower curtain um, so cheap I think I paid like seven dollars for the shower curtain um, and the material is um, not bad at all it comes with the little hooks um, it doesn't come with the plastic I already have any plastic so it will be okay but this is the shower curtain. Um, the material is great. It's not plastic. It's like material. And this is the print that I went with. It's like a, it's giving me um, like when you go to a spa vibes. Um, it's giving me relaxation vibes, and that's exactly what I wanted for my bathroom. I wanted to go in there and just feel. After such a long day, I wanted to feel relaxed. I wanted to go in there and be like, yes, I'm about to take a nice bath or shower and just feel relaxed. So this is what I went with. This is the material. It's just a bunch of leaves all the way down to the curtain. And we have the green, we have brown. Just, I love it. I think it's gonna look amazing and I'm super excited because this is for the first time I opened it up and it just looks so much pure in person. So this is it. Isn't it amazing? Look at the detail in it. For seven dollars, you can't beat that. So we went with this one. Me and my husband. Actually me, not my husband, me. I went with this one and I am so glad that I did because I don't regret it. 
it looks beautiful so along with that I did buy some floral arrangements um, how do you call this? Um, my mom's calling me I have to let her know I'm doing something so um, I I bought these floral arrangements as they're called eucalyptus flowers I think they're not real but I thought they would look good with the whole theme together and I bought some little pompa pump is that what you're calling it? I'll put the name down below but yeah I bought these and I thought they would go so cute together in a vase look at this they did not smell great but I'm gonna spray them they look so cute and I have a floral arrangement in the bathroom already so I figured I'd replace the flowers and uh, you know make it go all together I think it's gonna go great so I can't wait to film so my camera shut off okay so let's go a little quicker so that my camera doesn't shut off again although I do have a battery charging but yeah we did that um, I also bought these, this bathroom print. So this is gonna actually go outside of our bathroom door. This kind of splits up the bathroom. Um, it's like a sun, it just says bathroom, but again, it has that theme, floral theme, and I think it's gonna look great. Um, our kind of similar, um, as the bathroom sign but it's three four I think it's four pieces and they're um, like little frames to put in the bathroom I do have frames in my bathroom that I created and I just kind of want to replace those I will insert a picture of them because I kind of don't want to take them out right now it's hard to take them let me see Yeah, see what it's like. Okay, let's give you guys an idea of what it looks like. So they kind of look like that. They're a floral print that I could put on the wall. But I don't think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to buy frames for them. And frame them and then put them on the back and back. With command strips. So, let's see how that works out. I'll let you guys know. And last, Last but not least, I bought towels. I bought two different, actually it's not the last product. I have another product. I bought two colors, the green and the brown, and I thought these would look cute together. So, um, I have an open one. Don't know what they're gonna feel like, we'll see. And the material is okay, but again, I want it for decoration. It's not. Look at this. This is so pretty. I actually like the material. It's more like microfiber towels. And these are the towels that are gonna hang for people to like wipe their hands down or anything like that. So I don't mind the color at all. I think. I mean the material at all. And the towel. The big towel is this one. And it looks great. The green one is exactly the same color. In the same material as well so what i plan to do is put the brown one or the green one and put the brown one over or green towel green towel brown over or brown towel green over it so we'll see how that works out and last but not least to match the brown which i might actually do the brown small towel and the green big towel i got the brown floor mat which again was not expensive at all for everything here that I showed you guys I spent I think it was like 70 to 75 dollars which I'm happy with I'm surprised I got a few items for and this is the mat the bathroom again does not smell great like, I don't like the smell so Shane needs to do something about that um, but this is a bath mat. I think it looks great. It's so soft, so I like the material. I just 
I don't like the smell. It smells weird. But we can fix that with some blade powder and just vacuum it and make it work. So, um, yeah. I think everything is going well together. Again, I will try to link everything down below. But I just wanted to make this video because sometimes we go to Shane or I go to Shane for, you know, like clothing and stuff like that. But I never, until my husband mentioned it, I never looked for it. Um, bathroom decor or anything out of the ordinary so I'm glad I did because you know at least now I know Shane has a lot of things that I didn't think they had so if you guys are looking into getting decor or anything like that give Shane and no this is not I'm not sponsoring them <laughs> I'm not sponsored by them or anything or just doing a video for them no this is my personal opinion if you guys are looking into something that you can't find anywhere else, maybe Shane will have the decor or the specific item that you guys need for a specific room. So it's just to give you guys an idea of what they might have that you think they don't. So this is a Shane haul, a very short Shane haul, short video. Uh, I am... I just took my third shot of Wigovi, just in case you guys are wondering. So that means we got one more shot, and then I can give you guys an update on my Wigovi journey for month two. So I am excited, and I hope you guys are excited. That video will be coming soon. I've been talking about forever about Mila's um, early intervention video. It's so long. I've decided to re-record the video over and shorten it because there's just way too much information and I can't really cut it so I am starting fresh so be patient with me I will have that video for you guys and any other updates or any other videos will be coming soon um, I'm gonna try to post once a week but again be patient with me I am um, been feeling a little tired and haven't been able to really film as much as I want to so but I am slowly re I am reminding myself that not to be so hard on myself so same goes for you guys don't be so hard on yourself so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and for those who are watching thank you for watching for those who are new thank you for joining in I got a few new subscribers and I was so excited I don't have many but I was really excited and I want to thank you guys for taking the time to subscribe to my channel and I hope that you guys enjoy the content that I bring. So with that said, I will end this video. I hope you guys have a wonderful week, a wonderful night and yes, I will see you guys next time. Bye, thank you. Bye.